just made myself a hot drink and sat down. Haven't even taken a sip yet and I can hear Alex is awake. So I better go grab her. Oh, thank you. Big fun. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah, that's your bed. Do you want to wave to everyone? Say hi. Should we get you dressed? <laughs> um, it's very hard to wake up, isn't it? Yeah. You right? You right? Yeah. Should we get you dressed? one year needles on Friday so they have caught up with her today and she is quite clingy and very tired and very grumpy aren't you mm -hmm. is it a cuddle day today Alex Alex what did you do that for <coughs> I don't want them I want them back in the container can we put them back in the container together? Come on. Can you help mum? Oh, good girl. Thank you. Oh, good job. Hey, Alex. Alex, are we eating wheat bix on the ground because you wouldn't eat them anywhere else? Are we? Are you in a bit of a mood today? Hmm. I've told you you can't lock yourself in. <coughs> You've got to move back. Move back. Move back. Alex, <coughs> you've got to move back. <coughs> you got Alex. <laughs> there you go. Alex, are you ready to go to town? Hey, you ready to go to town? Get some groceries? So Alex and I just got to town. Um, we're in lockdown so we can only leave our house for essentials. So we're doing a grocery shop. Um, this afternoon I want to do some cooking. So um, I'm gonna grab some stuff for that and stuff for dinner tonight. It's nice to get out of the house even if it's just for a grocery shop. I think both of us needed it today. Alex is a bit grumpy as she's had her injections or well, she had her one year needles on Friday. So it seems to be messing with her a little bit. She's a bit upset. I'm trying not to get too frustrated because I know it's for a reason, but it was driving me a little bit crazy. So thought we'd come in for a grocery shop, grab the bits that we need. We've got to go to the pharmacy too. Um, so after that, then we'll head home. Does mum look funny? Does mum look funny? <laughs> Can mum have a kiss? Kiss? Mwah. Kiss for mum? Hey. Mwah. <laughs> So I've just got home, um, Alex is over there just playing on the couch. I'm going to unload all these groceries and then I'm hopefully going to get Alex down for a nap. That is on the tractor. We want the TV on. How about we go to bed? How about it's time for a nap? <laughs> nap time? What do you reckon? <laughs> what do you reckon? Is it nap time? So Alex has just woken up. I haven't done any cooking yet. I tried to do it when she first went to sleep, but it was too noisy. Our house is so little, so it's actually really hard 
um, to do anything while she's asleep just because it's so noisy and wakes her up. So I gave it a shot but it didn't work. Um, so I'm just about to cut up some strawberries and give her some yogurt for a snack and I'll make some quiches for her for the week to come. Alex is eating her snack now and I am going to make some mini quiches for her. She absolutely loves it. It's something that's easy for me to make um, and it's something that Mark and I can eat with her as well which is very handy because often whatever we're eating she wants to eat so this is a good recipe for that. A lot of you have asked me to do vlogs of um, snack ideas or dinner like meal time ideas so I thought I would show you guys how I make these quiches. So the first thing to do is just line the cupcake tin with the puff pastry for the bases of the quiches. Now it's time to go in the oven. And they are all done. So they only cooked for about 15 minutes and they look perfect. It's such a windy day today. I've just looked out inside and all my washing is flying off the washing light. So I'm going to pick that up and bring it all inside. Hopefully it's all dry. Are you right? Are you a bit cranky? <coughs> bit cranky. <coughs> this is about how our afternoon has gone. <coughs> You're okay. You're okay. <coughs> Do you want a quiche? Does that make you happy? Does food make you happy? Does it? <laughs> yeah? So it's the next morning, um, yesterday afternoon, 
not go to plan. Alex was quite grumpy and we didn't get much done, but that's okay. Um, and then last night, Alex decided to wake up at weird times and she has slept today until 11 o'clock. So um, this morning we've taken it pretty easy. It's about lunchtime now. Alex is just watching some Wiggles. She loves her Wiggles. I love Wiggles because I can get the stuff done, which is great. Um, but hopefully she's better this afternoon and I can get some jobs done. I'm just going to do the dishes now um, and then hopefully make some cookies for Mark this week. not my Santa. What's this one? We've got that's not my flamingo. Uh -huh. Oh, that's your favorite, isn't it? Where are you going? So Alex seems to be entertaining herself well at the moment. Um, and I've done most of the dishes, so now I'm just going to get started on the cookie. This is the 100 cookie recipe. I love it because it makes so many. Um, so all you need for this recipe is self-raising flour, sugar, butter, condensed milk, and chocolate chips. Definitely not the most healthy recipe in the world, but it's just for snacks for Mark, so that's fine. No stress there, but um, yes, I'll make them and give you guys the rundown of how to A lot of people push down their cookies um, before putting in the oven, but I actually don't like to do that. I like my cookies quite gooey, so I don't push them down, I leave it like that. So they were in there for about 10 minutes. Um, and I take them out as soon as they start getting that brown tinge on top because I like the cookies quite um, soft and gooey. I always take them out a little bit earlier than when they're fully cooked. So all done and I will do the rest of the batch and then just chuck it in a container in the pantry and Mark can help himself whenever he wants. Do you want to go for a drive? A drive on the farm? Should we go for a drive? No. Should we go for a drive? Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Sorry that that's been all over the place. That's been out the past. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> that's been the past two days, really, all over the place. But hopefully, you enjoyed it. If you did, please like the video and subscribe. And we'll see you in the next one.